Hey lovelies, this is what I got during the semi-annual uh, sale at Bath and Body Works. I know it's long overdue because this sale has been well over for a while now, but this is the only time I had time to film, so here it is. Disclosure, kids are home, you can hear some background noise, AC's on, I'm hot, it is what it is. Okay, everything in this bag I got... <laughs> Oh, excuse me. Everything in this bag I got for at least $4 and under. So, had some gift cards and stuff, some coupons, and there we go. That's how this happened. <laughs> Anyways, I'm actually wearing this one today. This one is the coconut pineapple, and it just sounds, just sounds, it just, it just smells like a pina colada. Really, really nice. So, we got that on today i also got oh sorry this doesn't belong in there i don't know how that got in there <laughs> i got the bath and body wear sunset glow now this has oh my gosh okay i feel terrible i forgot to read the notes of the first one pardon me okay so the fragrance notes for this one is shaved coconut fresh pineapple and sugar cane now let's move on and this one sunset glow this came out in new packaging because i believe this was already a scent but they revamped the packaging look how cute like look at the straw on the inside the little tube on the inside legit looks like a straw i think packaging and presentation is everything for this i love it and this right here has fragrance notes of fresh coconut sparkling cherry salsa dreamy moonflower and caramelized vanilla this this mm. this just smells mm, so nice like i smell the cherry and i smell the vanilla mm, it smells so good love this then next up i got the gingham vibrant so this right here has notes of wild blackberries candied violets and soft vanilla this also just it, it, it smells so feminine so so dainty and like kind of sweet floral mm. yeah love this i love you know the faceted bottles but i don't like the price they they charge more for like these faceted bottles that look like little gem things like that than they do the regular bottles which i think is complete bs but that is my opinion I still got that on sale though for let's just be clear for like four and under otherwise I wouldn't have gotten it if I can get a sell it okay just letting you know then from the same collection I got the gingham love and this one has fragrance notes of sugared red berries blushing freesia blushing freesia freesia you know what I'm trying to say <laughs> rose meringue and this one just like I smell the rose, but it doesn't smell like a mature rose to me. Like it's not giving me Vieja vibes. We don't know that means old lady, old lady. But it's it's nice. It's rose done right. Oh. The next one is at the beach. Now I've been eyeballing this for so long. And I feel like it only goes on sale when they do like the NIST sale. And um, they normally don't do it during semi-annual unless they're like retiring the packaging. Hence why this went on sale. They retired this packaging and came on new packaging. So I was stoked to pick this up. And this has notes of white frangipani blossoms, toasted coconut, bergamot water sea salt breeze and sun-kissed musk now i smell the musk it smells really nice i smell the coconut and what, what am i getting i guess i could kind of kind of smell like the the toastedness but not like not toasty like campfire toasty toasty like i don't know how to explain it but it smells really 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 nice like it perfect perfect for hence the name at the beach <laughs> like it doesn't smell like sunblock but it smells like you ever just walk on the beach 
and like you can smell like the wetness of the sand like i'm probably describing it and it sounds completely unappealing but i promise you it it smells really really good <clears throat> okay then the next one is groovy watermelon and this one has notes of juicy pink watermelon sugar strawberry blossoms and lime zest now this one i feel like it literally smells like a candied watermelon like a candy watermelon like um <clears throat> took my tongue uh you know the watermelon jolly ranchers that's what this smells like so it people may think this is like very like immature and kiddish smelling but i don't care like i love to smell either very sweet or like gourmand so like uh, floral not so much fresh not so much i feel like fresh and floral scents like i like them but i'm much more picky about them however sweet and gourmand scents i'm all about that life so yeah with this i definitely smell the watermelon and the strawberries but the watermelon is much more prominent and it's not uh it's not an actual watermelon smell it's definitely like that artificial candy watermelon smell but i love it <laughs> i'm here for it i love it okay and the next one is pure wonder now i've had this and like the minis before but never like the full size of body care this has notes of ice rose star jasmine and warm white amber so I definitely smell the amber. It's like I smell, I can kind of detect a little bit of the jasmine, but the amber is much more prominent, but it's not like, like a wintry amber smell. It's not too overpowering. So I feel like I can definitely pull this off during the summer. It smells really nice. So yeah, like I said, I, I do smell the amber, a little bit of the jasmine but I do smell, I do pick up on the amber mostly. Again, another love, I already know I like that scent, so. Okay, going on to more body care. I got the Pure Wonder Moisturizing um, Body Wash. Now, I actually prefer this body wash versus their gel body washes. I mean, I'll still pick up the gel body washes. It's also cheaper than this, but since this was on sale and I prefer this kind of formula more, I jumped on it when I saw this was on sale. So yeah, not much to say about that. It smells exactly like the um, the spray version of this. So there is that. Okay, I also got the at the beach body lotion. I was looking for the shower gel in this collection, but they didn't have any more. So I caved and I used my coupon and I got the new packaging of the shower gel. But because I didn't get it on sale, I didn't put it in with this haul, but I did pick that up. Again, smells just like the spray does. I think like the body care stuff was, aside from the moisturizing body wash, was like $4. or well, like 4 and change, I think. And at least all the sprays are kind of in that $4 range. And then the body care, like the lotions and stuff were like 3 and change. So again, I got the Pure Wonder of the lotion. So I actually have the whole collection. Like I have the moisturizing body wash of this now, as you saw. I have the lotion and I have the spray. So I'm definitely gonna put, maybe for a date night, I'll probably use this or a day date. We'll see. Okay, and then I picked up the Hello Beautiful. This just honestly, to me, smells like um what's the word i'm looking for let me read the notes okay <laughs> white gardenia jasmine petals magnolia blossom pink nectarine and cotton musk this to me is definitely a spring summer scent and it just it honestly just smells like a bunch of white florals so i actually like it this is one of the floral scents i can get on board with so I also picked up the body wash. I was looking for the body spray and it's like, I had it in my cart, but when I went to go check out, it was sold out. And I've been looking like every day during this sale to see if they were gonna put it back in stock. And every time they did, 
and I had it in my cart. It was like, whoop, out of sale, out of sale, out of sale. So I'm like, ugh. I mean, out of stock, out of stock. So I didn't end up getting it. But that's all right. I'll probably end up picking it up on like Amazon or everybody says go to Macari. I feel like Macari overcharges. Um, if I really want it, I'll find a way to get it. But I have no need or desire to get it right now. I'll probably match it with the uh, the Dior perfume I have, the white bottle, like the new one that just came out, the Jador Adore Eau de. Ad, for, please forgive me for my pronunciation, but. It's the white Dior bottle from the Adore collection that just came out not that long ago. I got that for Christmas. My husband got it for me. So I'll probably match that with that since that's full of white florals. So I think that would pair really nicely with this. And the rest is like uh, hand sanitizers. So we got Endless Sea. Some of the stuff, I'm not going to lie, I didn't get on the sale. But I got like when they just recently did like their dollar for the hand sanitizer sale. So a couple of these I did get just for a dollar and the rest I got on the sale. So if I remember to say what 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 was part of the sale, I'll let you know. So I got this. My youngest, my four-year-old Kyrie, kind of claimed this already. So I had to like take it from her stuff and put it in the bag just for the, the video purpose. So we got that. Uh, Japanese cherry blossom, I think I got this during the dollar sale as well. let's see and then we got the among the clouds i really wish they had this body care as part of sass because i really really want it so bad like i feel like i have like other stuff that would pair so nicely with this scent i also kind of wish they had the fragrance notes on the hand sanitizers but they don't Oh, I picked this up, but I just threw it in the little case. I picked this case up during Sass as well. I forgot how much this was, but it was dirt cheap. And I got the, what is this called? The Pink Pineapple Sunrise. Okay, I got this during the dollar sale. This is the Pear Vanilla. And I got this during the semi-annual sale. This is the Cocoa Paradise. I honestly was debating whether or not I wanted to get the the spray or the body care in this. So I'm like, mm, like, even though I liked it, I'm just like, I don't know. I just I didn't feel a, a desire to really pick it up, so I didn't. And this I got during the dollar sale, the Wild Sand. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoy this little semi annual. Uh, Bath and Body Works haul. I'm gonna try to do more body care like I said. It's just gonna take time So stay tuned. I hope you enjoyed and have a good one. Bye